why Python? Okay, now coming back to why Python. Python focuses on readability, coherence, and software quality in general, which sets it apart from other programming language and scripting world. And like I told, Python is not just a scripting language. It's object-oriented, powerful programming language, okay? And the quality of the software that you write using Python is extremely high because your programs are clean, it's not messy, it is auto-indented because indentation is the one and what the most important thing that you need to remember when you're writing a Python code. For example, look, look at my code over here. Does it look good? It, it, it's so clean, right? This is a class and then this is a function and this is what I've defined. Inside I've written a for statement, inside that I have one more for, for and so on and so forth, right? It's, it's a very clean code. If I were to show you similar Java code, uh, it might just look very messy. When I say Python is not just a simply a scripting language, for example, a simple scripting language, a cell is a simple scripting language. A batch, batch scripts are a simple scripting language, whereas Python is not. Python has your object-oriented features, okay? Thus, uh, in my fifth class, I will be taking you through to, um, you know, to the object-oriented nature of Python, wherein I'll be talking about polymorphism. You would never be able to do this, A plus B equal to seven and B plus D equal to hello world, you would never be able to do this in your normal scripting language. That's one thing. Thus, when I say it's not a scripting language, it's uh, it's not just procedural, right? It's about polymorphism. It's about inheritance. It's it's an object-oriented programming language altogether. So when it is a simple procedural or uh, scripting language, you you know you you will not be able to do a lot. You'll be able to write a simple top-down program. And that's it. You know, you you will not be able to do many things with that. But with Python, you can do a lot many more things. Okay, okay, that's does that help for now? If if you have not understood it, right? For now, just understand that Python is an object-oriented programming language and not a scripting language. But then people use Python extensively to write their scripts. So people think that it's a, it's a scripting language. That that's a simple explanation. Now. Developers' productivity Python code is typically one-third to one-fifth the size of equivalent C++ or Java code. That means there is less to type, less to debug, and less to maintain. Okay, so that's self-explanatory. Python programs run unchanged on all major computer platforms, for example, Windows, Linux, Mac, OS, etc. Uh, this is very important. Uh, whenever Whenever you write a Python code, right, you do not have to worry about uh, portability of your Python code. You can just take your Python code, uh, which you have written in Windows, and port it over to Mac and line, or Linux, and it will work perfectly fine. Python comes in with large collection of pre-built and portable functionality known as standard library. The library supports an array of application-level programming tasks from text pattern matching to network scripting. So. Uh, I remember having asked about what's the difference between R and what's the difference between Python, okay? Uh, yes, Rishabh, uh, okay, good question. Rishabh is saying, can we include Python code in Bash or vice versa? You will, you, you will be able to do that, Rishabh. You can embed your Python code in your cell script or your Bash code or, or your Hive code, anywhere, you'll be able to embed. Now, coming back to the support libraries, when I, when I said that uh, there is a difference between Python and uh, R, this is one of the major differences as well. Python has more than 50,000 developers who are contributing to making of Python libraries. Okay, that's a huge number. They are dedicated to making large number of Python libraries. The Python user base is very large as compared to your R, okay? R is mostly used for statistical modeling, but Python can be used to do an end-to-end -end task. For example, starting from your creation of website to data analytics to implementation of machine learning to writing big data, big data programs in Python. Python is 
Python is able to do everything, whereas R with R you cannot do all all those things. And component integration, Python scripts can easily communicate with other parts of application using a variety of integration mechanism. Uh, there, there you go, Resub. It this must uh, answer your question on integration of Python with other programs. And last but not the least, uh, you know, it's uh, because of ease of use and built-in tool set, it makes programming more uh, pleasurable. Python is uh, very easy to do and hence, uh, you know, because there are not many uh, syntax and semantics that you need to worry, it's, uh, it's quite an easy programming language. About Python, it was invented in Netherlands uh, in early 90s by Gudo van Rusum. So, you know, it's, it was not invented by someone named Python, it was by Gudo van Rusum. Okay. Named after Monty Python, a comedy group, as Python is fun to use. It's open source and interpreted. Considered a scripting language, but it's much more than that. Okay, it's an object-oriented programming language. That's what I've been talking about. It's scalable and object-oriented object and functional. Used by Google, increasingly popular. We all understand that. Python job trends from Indeed.com shows remarkable increase. Look at the comparison, okay? Java is right at the bottom. What's this? PHP is little up, but then Python is more than double of what PHP is, right? Uh, this is uh, the trend for Python, okay? There you go. Python is at the top of the list among the top dogs. Java, JavaScript, PHP, according to Red Monk, first quarter plot for 2014 ranking. Okay, and Python, the demand for Python is just growing every day. Just go to this uh, link that we have given over here from redmonkindy.com and you will see the demand of Python. 